Hi everybody, thanks for clicking in and um, I'm very excited today because I received my Ron Ransom package of brushes in the mail today and I wanted to jump on and unpack those with you. And uh, before I do, just a little explanation. Lately I've been very interested in painting with bigger brushes and painting landscapes. And one thing led to another and I ended up finding this group of artists online who are following an artist named Ron Ranson, who is considered the master of painting um, fast and loose, big brush landscapes. So it's really interesting that there's a group of people out there who are all pursuing the same interest in painting. And um, I, I just took to it like a duck in water. So I'm having a great time. And these brushes came available. And evidently, the artist Ron Ranson collaborated with a company called ProArt and developed a set of brushes that would um, just be perfect for his style of painting. And when I saw these brushes, I knew right away that I had to have them. So I ordered them and they come from the UK and Amazon has picked them up. So they're really easy to get now. And you, if you have Prime, you can get them on Prime and avoid shipping charges and everything else and all the hassle of getting things from the UK. So I just wanted to jump on and, and show you what I got and explain a little bit about big brush painting. And one of the brushes in big brush painting that are, is becoming very popular is called the hockey brush. And this is a large, very soft goat hair brush, holds a lot of water and a lot of pigment. And people are starting to paint landscapes primarily with this one brush and maybe a rigger and a flat. So it's really exciting and it's fun. And um, so let's, I'm gonna flip over to my work table so that you can see uh, what's inside this package. I'm so excited, I can't wait to get started. I know there will be more videos coming with um, actually using these brushes, but for right now, we're just gonna unpack and see what we've got. So when we're talking about painting landscapes with big brushes, fast and loose, this is basically the style of painting that we are doing. And this was done mostly with a, um, with a hockey brush that I had previously and a three quarter inch flat and a rigger for the final details. So that, just to explain to you why we're using big brushes, these are the kinds of paintings that we're going for. So let's get to our package from Amazon. I, I'll just go through each one and tell you what it is. You can buy these brushes singly, but I'll tell you, it's a really good deal if you buy these brushes as a set. First of all, you get a DVD, which I haven't had a chance to look at yet, but it's by Ron Ransom himself demonstrating the use of these brushes. So we'll definitely be taking advantage of that a little later on today. The next thing that we get is a nice brochure that has all of the brushes that are available from ProArt, including the Ron Ransom set. And if you want to go online and look at any of these brushes, there is a website and I'll give you that. Um, it is, might be a little hard to see here. Let me hold it up so you can see it. It's www.proart.co.uk. And if you go there, I'm sure that you'll be able to see all the brushes that are available as well. So we get a nice brochure. And now for the good stuff. We get four brushes inside. And the first one is a number 14 round. And you can see that the ferrule is round. And uh, that's why they call it a round. But this one, I'm gonna actually dip it in some water here so that you can see that even though it's called a round brush, it has a nice point on it. I don't know if you can see that. There we go. 
Okay, it's got a very nice point on it. It holds a lot of water. This is a synthetic brush, but it feels like um, it feels like a sable. Okay, the next brush that we have, and oh, by the way, this is a number 14 round, and it's from the it's, a, it's from the series 101. So if you're looking in the brochure, it will say 101 on it and then a number 14. Okay, and it's in the round section. Okay, the next one that, w that we have is a flat, but this is a special flat because if you, if you look at it, the shape, of the, the shape of it is a little bit different. It's a little bit rounded. I'll try to hold it still so you can see it. There we go. The bristles themselves are a little bit rounded rather than um, just straight across. So this is a three quarter inch flat and it is an, uh, in the series 106 if you're looking for it in the brochure. Okay, the next one that I can't wait to paint with is not actually part of that series but this is called a sword brush it's in the brochure and you can see look at the point on that sword brush can't wait to see what it can do it's a medium sword that comes in the set and the fourth brush is a number two and this is your rigor let me try to get it to where you can see it. It's a long rigger. It's a number two in its series 103. And now for the pride and joy of the set, and really what I bought the set for, is the hockey brush itself. And this is a medium hockey. It is the Ron Ranson Hockey. The series number on this is 506-86445, but you don't need that. You just look for the medium run Ranson hockey. And what's different about this hockey brush, okay, I'm gonna wet my old one and show it to you. Okay, let me move this so that you can actually see the brush. Okay, this is my old hockey brush. And this is the Ron Ranson hockey brush. The difference is the chisel point. Okay, you see? On my old brush, it's pretty um, fluffy all the way through, even when it's wet. But look at the, um, you get a chisel point on this one. And the shape is a little bit different. It's a little more rounded. This makes it better to paint trees, bushes, all kinds of foliage. You can paint um, masts on sailboats by using the chisel point, um, just all kinds of things. Um, tree lines, branches. I can't wait to use this hockey brush. It covers a lot of paper. It's good for washes. It just has a million uses, and I can see why it's becoming very, very popular for people to use to do complete paintings. So that is, um, these are the brushes that come in this set. These three are actually, these black ones, these are actually in the line. The sword brush is an add-on and the hockey brush is in a class by itself. So can't wait to use these brushes. I hope you will come back and join me for uh, some painting videos using these brushes on the big brush landscape painting. And here's another really nice brochure that explains a little bit about Ron Ranson and about his his uh, style of painting and how it was developed. So if you're looking for this, you can go on Amazon. You can Google Ron Ranson Hockey Brush Set 
on Amazon and it will come up for you and you'll be able to get it right on Prime if you have Prime. So thanks for jumping on with me today and I'll see you in the next one.